I love Edmode Owen. One of the things I really love about it is there's a lot of teacher feedback and they really listen to teacher feedback. Um, through the educational gamification group, um, it was suggested that putting badges in to gamify um, classrooms was a great idea. So about a year and a half ago, they actually put in badges. So it's a good reward system. You can use it to gamify your classroom or just to reward certain students for good work. Um, and it's really become very, very easy to use it. And there's a lot of badges there for you. So we're going to look at how to um, award a badge, how to create a badge, and looking at the different ways we can actually use it within our groups. So I've started with um, a group from last year and we'll show you first of all how to actually award a badge. So we'll go into this students and basically you'll see under here award badge. Now at the moment I have about 75 badges and they come from other teachers. So I'll show you a bit later how to actually get these. So to award a badge, you choose one first. So let's say gold, and then it will award that. And you'll notice here that um, she now has one badge. Now to have a look at that, you can go up to her profile and it will actually show the badge. So she's got one badge then. Click on that, one badge earned. And when you click on that badge, you um, can actually see the teachers that she has. I gave her the badge and I can revoke that badge very, very quickly. But once you've given it generally with gamification, you want them to uh, keep it. So we'll go back to that group again. Now the next thing is we're actually going to learn how to create a new badge. So you can go into any students click award badge again and you'll notice here that we have um, student badges we have badges that Edmodo have actually put up and you can actually create your own badge so I'm going to create a new badge and at our school we have swans as different um, subjects so I've got the math swan there we're going to make a badge out of it um, that's and you basically need an image that's 114 by 114 pixels, but it's not quite there. It basically will get scaled. So we'll go up, find our badge. There's the maths one. Click open, and it will basically bring it down and convert it to 114 by 114. Now this button here, share this badge with other teachers, the great thing about Edmodo is the people that use it are all around the world. So I always share off any badges with other teachers because I've got so many badges from them. Click create the badge and you'll notice up here now I have a new badge and it's basically put into this round. So it really makes it easy. Now if I want to delete a badge I can then see the maths one, this little pencil, this is the edit badge. And at this point, I can actually edit it, change what I put in the description, or I can delete it. So I'm going to delete that. Remember, if you do delete a badge and you've awarded it to a couple of students, any student that had that badge will actually lose that badge. So we've learned how to create our own badges but as I was saying earlier there is another way and that's actually um, taking some really great badges from other teachers so the way to do that go up into your profile and all I do is I go into my connections I'll just scroll through and find someone who's going to have some badges I'll go to um, Brett Gosling he's over in the US and there's a big gamer and go down you'll see the teacher badges and shared student badges so you click on that and then have a look and you'll notice I probably have a couple of um, the badges and they they're all very much shared around I'll take gold medal add to my student badges 
silver medal, add to my student badges, and let's go bronze. Just and that basically is the way that you can actually share and also take. So it's just about give and take, really. So if you look at um, this is my one here. Now you'll notice that I have those three badges sitting in there. Now we'll go back to home. I'm going to show you a really great way of actually um, awarding badges across a whole class. And this only happened since the new Edmodo started. So basically we're going to go into progress. And I'm going to go to a class I had last year. And this is basically their grade book. So the assignments at the top, uh, the scores, and you'll see here that these link assignments were the gamification assignment. So click on badge, and you can actually add badges along here. So you click add badge, brings up what you've got here. Now I'm going to put the um, swans, so add this to the group. And one more, the integrity swan. So the great thing about this now is I have all of my students here. I can go, okay, well, everyone's achieved today. Put that in. So they all get the badge. Then maybe one or two have had responsibility and respect. Now, when you go back to their profiles, those badges will be up straight away. Uh, but you can also revoke them very quickly by just clicking again so they come off. So that really makes quite a difference when you've got big classes or a couple of classes and you want to gamify. Look, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, the badges is really a, a very unique um, part of Edmodo. And just remember there are other tutorials on different aspects of um, using Edmodo in YouTube and SchoolTube.